The Golden Gate Bridge is one of the engineering marvels of the world and an iconic Bay Area landmark. Unfortunately, it's also been the scene of a number of tragic head-on traffic collisions until recently when the Golden Gate Bridge District installed a movable barrier. Isn't this an amazing view behind me? Uh, I'm talking about the barrier. Uh, it wasn't here a year and a half ago, and it's beautiful. It saves lives. They've been talking about a barrier on the bridge for as long as I can remember. So to see it here, it's, uh, I like it. Uh, prior to the installation of the barrier, we had over 100 horrific head-on accidents in the decades preceding this installation. We had 16 deaths. Since October of 1963, we've had reversible lanes on the Golden Gate Bridge. For the first 40 years of reversible lanes on the bridge, the only thing separating northbound and southbound traffic were these plastic tubes. But I did see a couple times where people would U-turn out of nowhere on the bridge, and I thought that was a major issue. These always seem vulnerable. If something would happen, someone could just swerve into your lane. With the installation of the barrier, we've stopped head-on accidents. It saves lives. It costs $25 million and time. And this took, uh, you know, 25 years of refinement and design work. The general idea is used around the world in different applications. But here on the Golden Gate Bridge, the need for a narrower barrier, the need to go around corners, and all of the particulars of the Golden Gate Bridge make this particular system unique to us. It was a complex project, but um, in, uh, in the retrospect, the, the best time it was when we were seeing barrier being installed uh, during the complete closure of the bridge. MTC's Award of Merit recognizes the bridge district for finding just the right solution to make travel through the Golden Gate Corridor safer for everyone.